Hey guys, I've got the list. Quentin Tarantino's top 10 movies of 2013. But first today's video. Oh, maybe. What do you think? I want to move in together. No! I've got it. We're gonna have a bachelor party. I'm talking about a bachelor party so awesome and so epic. You're gonna stay a bachelor. Welcome to the first annual Monogamy Annihilation Tour. I love fun. Just last week I took my family to an Indian restaurant. We are going to get ridiculously drunk. Ladies and gentlemen, shots all around. We're gonna fight bears who are holding weapons. Guys, there's been a big misunderstanding. He doesn't wanna fight. And we're gonna have unprotected sex with women. No, don't worry about it. I'm gonna bone these two losers. Look at these white dudes. Focus up, y'all. Where exactly are we going? Who the hell do a drink at Meta, yo? <laughs> the most legendary night of Jimmy's life. We're gonna get sloppy. Mistakes will be made. Didn't think we'd wake up together ever again. Let's go. Come make music with me, Stan. Shut up, Bozo. We've got a fondue set. I bet you do. Quentin Tarantino has taken to publicly publishing a list of his top 10 movies from each year and has released a list of his 10 favorite films. There's a surprising number of big popcorn blockbusters here. Here's the filmmaker's full roster so far. Afternoon Delight by Jill Solway, Before Midnight by Richard Linklater, Blue Jasmine by Woody Allen, The Conjuring by James Wan, Drinking Buddies by Joe Swanberg, Francis Ha by Noah Baumbach, Gravity by Alfonso Cuaron, Kick-Ass 2 by Jeff Wadlow, The Low Ranger by Gore Wembiski, and This is the End by Seth Rogen Evan Goldberg. So, what do you think? Tarantino has promised an updated version of the list over the next few months when more Oscar contenders join the mix, so stay tuned for that. Thanks for watching. Follow us on Twitter at FilmIsNow and see you next time.